Welcome to Such as Georgia. This beautiful, wholesome town has everything you need. My name is Jason Velasquez, and I'll be your unofficial tour guide. Looking to do some hiking? Take a stroll down our Woody Gap Trail. That's a weird name. Or how about some breathtaking views? Let us show you our Gooch Gap Loop. Gooch Gap. If camping's your thing, feel free to park your RV in our Deep Hole Campground. It's named Deep Hole. That's the name. And at the end of the day, if nature's proving to be too hard, find some relief in coming. Georgia, just a short drive south. Oh, come on, Who the, who's naming these? A 10-year-old kid? Yo, 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 ready for this. I'm Jason. I just threw all my stuff in storage to start a travel blog during a pandemic. I'm on a mission to find the most secluded places and weirdest Airbnbs in the country. And to be honest with you, I have no idea what I'm doing and I'm almost certainly going through a midlife crisis, but I have supportive friends and family and it beats getting your ear pierced. This is Secluded Places. So this is my first episode. I go to North Georgia, I rent a tiny cabin, I check out Vogel State Park. Stay with me, I'll give you all the details. I also learned that making this show means there are a lot of moving parts that I simply do not have control over. So the code that they gave me doesn't work. I have two options. I can drive 15 minutes down the road to where I have cell reception, or I can try to find another way into this cabin. I don't want to drive. Make sure you screenshot everything that Getaway Cabin gives you. The address to get here, the code to get in, because you'll likely have bad cell reception. I would even say download the whole town of Suches onto Google Maps. So if you do lose cell reception, you can still get around. Bring your own food because the choices here are sparse. You can cook in the cabin in a little hot plate or outside the cabin in a fire pit, which is really, really cool. I don't know if that's the best choice for the summertime. I'm already sweating, uh, but I think I'm gonna do it anyways. I really like it. There's a Walmart uh, in Dahlonega. I'll put the directions in the description so you can stop there, it's on the way. After that Walmart, there's not much else. So uh, just keep that in mind. So that was my third time going to North Georgia trying to shoot this first episode. The first time I went, I checked out Vogel State Park. When I showed my footage to my best friend and creative partner, she had a lot of questions. Turns out I was hiding from the camera a bit. Maybe I felt a little insecure, but good catch, Hannah. I wasn't gonna show it, but here's Vogel State Park. Today we'll be hiking up the Coosa Backcountry Trail. It goes up both mountains, so expect some amazing... It's 13 miles. What? It's a 13 mile hike. Oh yeah, we, we knew that. So obviously we're not hiking up a 13 mile trail today. Not that I couldn't do it, I totally could. It's just my thumbs hurt and Whole Foods didn't have the macadamia cliff bars, so we're just ill prepared. After Vogel State Park, I went to the cabin and checked in. My plan was to show off some cooking on the fire, maybe eat a s'more, but you can't account for the weather. <laughs>
the second time I went up to North Georgia, it was better. I felt better about the footage and I felt better about just the work. But then I got cocky. So I, I climbed down to the riverbed because I tried to take a, a drone shot of the river. Fuck. I just got that thing. I'm not skilled enough to have tried that. It would have been a dope shot. <laughs> oh, fuck. stuck in me that's dope 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 good time hello everyone and welcome to Newark Ger